Hello everybody. So today we're going to look at the default third person character that comes with a template and how changing certain rotation settings can change the your gameplay mechanics and control mechanics of the character. So this is just a default third person character and what I've done is I've just gone to the top there filtered for rotation and what we're interested in are these rotation options so by default the character is or has orient rotation to movement and everything else is being unticked so when we play with this character and this is my level so I've just got four different characters they're all duplicates just with different settings so if we play this is the default character and as you can see just orient rotation to movement is true and we get this kind of a, an approach so the character just orients themselves in the direction of the movement when we are stationary the camera goes around the character but the character faces always in the same direction in this character We've turned off Orient Rotation to Movement and turned on Use Controller Rotation Yaw. So now, because Orient Rotation to Movement is off, we now get this strafing animations. And all of the characters are using the exact same blend space. When stationary though, as I turn the camera, the, the character turns the face in the same direction. Essentially just snaps there no matter how fast I go. In the third version, we've got Use Controller Desired Rotation and the other two options, the Orient Rotation to Movement and Controller Rotation Yaw are turned off. So again, when we're moving, we get the strafe. But now when I turn the character, if you do it fast, you notice that the character rotates to face that direction rather than just snapping. And in our fourth character, we've turned off everything, so unticked it all. So we get the strafe, the character turns around, but then we get this odd kind of a, a different type of mechanic when the character is moving based on the camera direction. So in terms of the options available, this is the default but we don't get any strafing animations because orient rotation to movement is true. In our third character, we've got use control desired rotation. So we get the strafing and we also get this, but we get this one where, where when we turn the character when they're stationary, they turn at the same time and what we probably want is this type of a mechanic where when the character is stationary the camera simply rotates around them in other words we want a combination so we want orient rotation to movement to be false but when they're stationary we want to turn off the use controller desired rotation So we can do that in Blueprints. So if we go back to our character here, we can see that both of those options are available under the character movement. And we're going to leave controller ro rotation your off, which comes with the pawn. So as we want to have strafing animations, by default we want the orient rotation to movement to be off then we do want the character to turn in the direction of the camera when we are actually moving but we want this to be off when the character is stationary so we can set that in the blueprint so if we go to the blueprint of our player character and we look for the input action move we know that from the character movement we can 
say set use controller desired rotation we want to turn that on when the move starts and we want to turn that off when the movement ends So now if we play with our, and if we get another character with the default settings, and we possess this character, and the other character we unpossess. So now when we play, everything is off to begin with so we get this camera rotates around the player as we start to move the player starts does move in the direction our camera is facing and when we stop we can now spin around again and that might be a control mechanic that you would like to have in the game Now when it comes to the speed at which the character rotates using the controller desired rotation, if we go back to our character, again filtered under character movement for rotation, there is a rotation rate here. So the default is 500. If we were for instance to put that slower, if we play the game, and we possess our purple character who's using desired rotation. When I turn him quickly, that rotation rate determines how fast he rotates to face in that direction. So the default is 500, and we can obviously set that here in the blueprints. <laughs> 